guys. Welcome back to another Frugal Finds Healthy Haul Top Up. So I haven't actually been out in a couple of weeks because the weather's been bad, the roads have been bad, and I haven't felt super fantastic. So yesterday I decided to go ahead and journey forth because the Kroger ad was changing and there were some things on special in there that I wanted to get before they went off special. Now, sadly, of like the six things that I went specifically to get, I got two. <laughs> the rest of them they either didn't have um, or they were out of stock. I don't know about where you guys are, but <clears throat> our supermarkets are looking a bit scarce in some spots. But I was able to get some good things on Markdown, and that always more than makes up for it. Okay. So I'll start on the left-hand side. I did get, they had orange juice on sale, two for six for the big containers. And then in their clearance, they had some lentil, spinach, and basil sort of rotini. And that was marked down to $1.59 a box. So I got a couple of those. Then in their Simple Truth range, they had two types of flatbread crackers. So this is their cheese and garlic. That's what they look like. And they are 130 calories for four pieces. And there is your ingredient label. Looks good, looks good. And they also had chia and flax flatbreads. Same nutritional content, 130 for four pieces. Slightly different ingredient label. And they had these on sale if you had the coupon. They had those on sale for $1.50 a box. So I got a couple of each of those to try. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm a little froggy this morning. I apologize. I picked up a couple of juices from Concentrate. An apple and a limeade. And I've made the limeade one. Now, most of the frozen ones... I haven't bought because they had all kinds of extra ingredients. But this particular one is just a concentrated apple juice, water, and Vite C. And the same with the limeade. It was, there was nothing in there. So I got a couple of those. They had those marked down to $1.69. And if you've looked at the price of normal apple juice, it's like <clears throat> $2.99 if it's on sale, $3.99 sometimes. So for $1.69, Make up your own. Also in their clearance rack, for $2.79, they had some Italian breadcrumbs. Normally I use panko, but those looked good. And again, double checked the label for that and that all looks good, so I got those. Now if you've seen any of my sesame uh, peanut ramen bowl, videos I found it all started because I ordered this ramen kit from we which is an international supermarket really really liked it they ran out of stock they haven't had it for I don't know how long so I ordered a sesame and peanut paste from them which it says the ingredients are just 50% peanut 50% sesame seeds which is tahini well yesterday they had some stuff on sale and I'm going to try my own. I found a crunchy peanut butter which is two ingredients and that is just your peanuts and salt. <coughs> and then this one they did have a normal tahini but I opted for the garlic tahini which is just organic roasted and ground sesame seeds, garlic powder, and salt. Now, if you've never had tahini, it is pricey calorie-wise, 220 calories for two tablespoons. And my peanut butter is 180 for two tablespoons. So that averages out to 200 calories per two tablespoons. And that's about what I found I was using of the paste, was two tablespoons. I'll have to play around with that and see. 
they also had, so they had all of their nut butters and stuff on sale. So I found some Simple Truth Honey Almond Butter. And I've never had almond butter or honey butter. So that is just your dry roasted almonds, cane sugar, honey, palm oil, and sea salt. And that, again, very similar in calories, 180 for two tablespoons. So <clears throat> looking forward to trying that. One of the things I did go in for, because it was on special, is these guys have super, super clean ingredient labels. So this particular one, which is a green sauce, is a tomatillo base. Then you've got your bell peppers, onions, water, jalapenos, apple cider vinegar, garlic, avocado oil, dates, sea salt, chia seeds, flax seeds, black pepper, and turmeric. That sounded really good to me. I haven't tried this yet, but I like this brand. And it is 25 calories for a quarter of a cup. So I'm hoping that that is really good. That's my air fryer. Hold on two seconds. <clears throat> okay. I also picked up some of the natural chicken breast. This is one that I've told you about before that only has chicken breast, water, and salt. A lot of the canned chickens have extra things in there. And they had these on sale for $2.79 instead of, uh, I think they're normally $3.79. So I went ahead and got three cans of those. Then in their meat department, they had a shoulder roast, Marked down from 1774 to 1108. And I've been thinking about beef jerky. And I found some thin strip steaks, 1025 to 870, uh, sorry, 867. Got a little dyslexia going on there. Dysgraphia, actually, with numbers. Um, but I'm going to cut this up. And I'm going to use probably half of this for doing some beef jerky. They had the Adele's range. If you've seen me talk about the meatballs that they do, that's what I went in for because they were on special. But they didn't have any and there was no tag for them. I don't think they carry them anymore. But I did find these. And I haven't tried these. I'm actually going to have these this morning for breakfast. So they are 160 calories a link. And really nice, clean ingredient label. So I'm excited to try those this morning. <clears throat> and then I picked up some of the uncured ham. So uncured is when the, you don't have any nitrites or nitrates or anything like that. That's, that was good. I got that last time too. Then in my produce, and we'll just kind of zip through these because there's not really any ingredients to tell you. <laughs> there was a stir fry veggie kit marked down, some sugar snap peas, and some English peas marked down. <clears throat> a bag of navel oranges. Anything in the red bags are 99 cents. Their English cucumbers were two for three, and they were really good size this week. I mean, those guys are huge. I got some more sweet peppers. Their red cherries were $2.99 a pound. The red pears were $2.99 a pound. And I picked up some more organic bananas. So that is everything. A couple of new products to try. I'll let you know in tonight's, uh, in today's video, what I think about these sausages. And that's it. We're all set.